almost all longtime Summerland people have collections of cannonballs. Almost all of everybody. So if, if people have lived here a long time, they got one or two cannonballs in their backyard. Unique rock formations have been found around Summerland for years, but geologists are looking once again at the spherical shaped cannonballs among the hills. Summerland area, the, a geologic wonderland, and it really is, and this is part of it. It's a pretty dense rock, so it's heavy. When you pick it up, it's heavier than you think. Okay, and the characteristics of it, it's got a crusty surface on it, like that. Um, and, and one of the things, when you extract it, this from the rock, you have to be really careful because any stress put on this, it'll split exactly in half, like be totally in half. And the inside part is, there's no crystals inside. These rocks are thought to be created from extinct volcanoes in the area, but their exact creation is still being looked into. They're looking at density, like density is pretty important for, you know, is it really lava related? It, it surely is. Uh, but also like how, do, how it forms spheres like this, like there's some physics behind how these are formed and, and that's I think that's what they're, they're thinking about is it's it's dripping already in a, a, like a lava lake with water and a, a volcanic ash. The stones have gained such an interest that the Fitzpatrick winery wanted to display them and use them as inspiration for some of their wines. We like to tell stories and every good bottle of wine should have a story uh, and just because of the relationship with geology and the dirt that we're working with uh, we just thought it was fun to share that with, uh, with visitors. We first did a, a specialty, especially the house here at Fitzpatrick Family Vineyards, of Sparkling Wine. We like that name so much that uh, we're going to be releasing, about this time next year, a gamay that we're calling our Cannonball Gamay, uh, in honor of these interesting uh, geological uh, activity. While Gregory has been finding these rocks for over 30 years, he's hoping others in the Okanagan have also found some of these lava drops to pinpoint how far exactly these rocks reach. To contact him, reach him at 250-494-9030 to show off your findings. For Castanet News, I'm Casey Richardson.